Children battling cancer and other life-threatening illnesses are having joy delivered right to their homes or their hospital rooms in some cases in the form of hero packages. The toys are delivered by a South Kingstown police officer whose passion project is now getting attention all across the country. 12 News reporter Kate Walsh takes us on a very sweet delivery. It's an idea that's really catching on, and now local police departments across Rhode Island and some in other states are donating money and toys to this organization to help in the efforts and raise awareness. It's tough for a brave superhero to stay indoors all day, but at his home in Chapachet with his two brothers and parents is the safest place for four year old Sammy, who just received a bone marrow transplant. This is for you. Any germs or dirt could make him very sick. I got more, okay? <laughs> it was all smiles this Saturday morning when Sammy and his two brothers got a cool electric car, lots of goodies, and even a cape and mask dropped off on their front steps by a community hero, South Kingstown police officer Jennifer Pacheco. It's just something about it. I, I think I was supposed to do this. She's dedicated all of her spare time in between long rotating shifts to creating the Hero Package Foundation, an organization delivering toys and care packages to children back battling cancer and their families. I started it two months ago. Uh, my inspiration to, to start the foundation was actually when I met um, three-year-old Emerson, uh, my first year on the job as a police officer. Um, at three years old, she was battling acute myeloid leukemia um, for the third time. I brought her um, a care package in the hospital with a couple other officers. She said Emerson is now five years old and cancer-free. The packages making their way across the country to California and other states. At that time, you need all the support that you can get. You know, you're being thrown into a battle that you were not prepared for. Right. So the support that you get is, you know, it's awesome. And they love it. You know, they love getting packages with their name on it. Four-year-old Maurice heroically got through a year of cancer treatment. He now wants to be a police officer. After getting Officer Jen's package, complete with toy handcuffs, police pajamas, and goodies for his sister. His mom says it's all about raising awareness across the country. That they are here, they are going through this, and we do need better treatment, you know, and... That's going to help. She is a very big force. We should mention that Foster Police Department funded the toys for Sammy's package, and East Providence Police paid for his awesome new car. If you'd like to help donate, you can find out how on our website at WPRI.com. I'm Kate Walsh, 12 News.